Hi, it's Dr. Centeno, and this is the CCI Type Series, Type 2A, Transverse Ligament Laxity. So the transverse ligament acts as a seatbelt for the dens. It binds C1 to C2, and it prevents that dens from coming backwards towards the spinal cord. If it's loose, uh, C1 separates from C2, and again, that dens comes backwards towards the brainstem and spinal cord when you look down. Now, we can test the ligament with either flexion extension x-rays, or we can also use digital motion x-ray to take a look at the atlantodental interspace. This type of CCI can cause headaches, dizziness, imbalance, autonomic symptoms, and many other types of symptoms. And a C1-C2 fusion is always a treatment option, but that's very invasive. I invented the PICL procedure as a non-surgical injection-based way to target that transverse ligament and get it to heal or tighten down. To learn more about the PICL, join the discussion on Reddit at rpicl.